opening line. Bend that ass over. Let that. Yeah, this is what I'm talking about. Like, I knew this line, but the rest of the song, I did not know that shit. I'm not listening. I could have named the lyrics in my mind, low key. Oh, yeah. Yo. I'm saying that I'm bullshit. Saying that. All right, guys, songs you should never play on the Ox by Word. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please subscribe to the bell and let's get notified when I upload a new video. Comment what do you guys want to react to next. And um, yeah, let's get into the video. The Ox. Getting the Ox is a blessing. You know, don't get me wrong. But some people have no idea when to give up the Ox. Today, we're going over songs you should never play on Ox. All right, now, what's this his first song? Because Loki, I, I, I really would usually just play something like Travis so Scott or something. Rules, and then I'm, we'll get I'm, I'm a big fan of Travis Scott, Loki. never play on Ox. Well, at least in my opinion. Rule number one of having the Ox. Do not replay songs over and over again. Like, for the love of God. Yeah, because Loki, when I say that, sometimes gets very annowing. Like, Loki. Like, 50 times. But these people are doing tricks, glazing. Okay, Loki, Loki. Yeah. Okay, yeah, Loki Fit is kind of overplayed, but, like, I'm kind of a big Travis Scott fan, so sometimes I'll either play Finn a lot or I'll play it with um, Finn slash Carnival, but, because, Loki, I really like Travis Scott, but I gotta agree with this rule when I say sometimes you really shouldn't be playing songs over and over. He's in just doing the most to get Fiend on the Ox. If it plays one time, I don't care, I'll turn up to it. But once we get in the territory of like 10 times, please play different shit, oh my god. The only time I replay songs like that is when I'm in the car by myself. If you're at a party around a bunch yeah, of Yeah, if you're at a party, never play the same song. Because like, there's a bunch of like, hype slash party songs you could play. If you're in the car, we that's different. Have those songs we just got on repeat over and over again. But you gotta understand, when you're around other people, you gotta pack that shit up bro people want to hear other music besides just one song the second rule of having the aux know what songs go with what environment bro if i'm at a party turning up i'm not trying to hear no spiritual lyrical <laughs> yeah okay this ass shit i can definitely like, this one can like play up. something like hype like a party shit. type of song play, like, like toe at every party it can really just be any song that will get people turned like up. just no, know the environment and know know the like, like the you know atmosphere like, you can't just play, like, I don't know, ta a like a Taylor Swift song at, like, a party where everyone's trying to get hyped and, like, everyone's smoking. play, like, the most popular songs either. People have to know it, but you don't have to play a safety song for every single song. That's something I see people do a lot when they get past the ox. They kind of just rely on certain songs to be, I guess, like, some kind of safety net for them. So they don't lose the ox core. I mean, if it's a, like, popular song, that's totally different. But sometimes you also, sometimes have a mix of popular songs and like po and like you know There's songs no that were popular but aren't as popular now because like you know family actually certain songs that were like very old are still pretty good to play as at a party low-key i listen to regularly at a family barbecue oh, i would get cooked like i don't think there's any saving me i'm losing the ox none of my family listens to rap at all and i also listen to underground rap too so if i played underground rap shit i would get kicked I mean, out of can the house, an underground rapper right now ox. i listen to but yeah when i'm with my family Family, I don't know. I usually okay, not really. I, I need to listen to more underground like rappers, but I can't name one at the moment in my head. Anybody would know like songs that have been on the radio and stuff. But of course, I actually play songs that I mess with. Right? I'm not gonna play straight ass at the family function either. But if I'm in the car with my friends, obviously I'm playing rap because I know they all mess with rap. Rule number four: Do not take garbage requests don't never do not take that disrespect like, listen it's, it's your ox bro. it's your car you your control. ox Everybody's your party gonna blame you if you put on don't don't play some shitty like songs someone wants to hear like i don't know like like weird like what like taylor swift or in our got actually let me number one that shit was a meme in like, like 2016 bro no one is this is what i'm talking about this is what i'm talking about like, I like the song. I like the song. Like, we are number one. I'm not gonna hold you when I say it. I kind of enjoy the song.
is playing that. But of course, you still got to take requests. You know, he can't be hogging the ox out here. Like, yeah, sure. Yeah, because sometimes people are just you're like hog, hog riding the holy shit out of it. Keep either. Imagine if you're in a whip, car full of girls drive by, and y'all are playing. We are number. <laughs> we are number one. Like, I would. <laughs> Loki, I would. I'd be embarrassed. Like, I got a girlfriend now, so I don't think I gotta worry about you know, this. But it's just like he, that would have saved me another sleepless night of just thinking about that over and over again. Rule number five you have to know when your time is up if you're on like a long ass car trip and you've been on ox for a while you know it's time to sometimes pass, pass that shit up you know so, don't because so, yeah like because you're hogging the shit out of it and like yeah you're playing good songs but it's like you know maybe someone else has like another good song that you they can play but you're not like letting them playing so it's like agrees you just have to give it up like give the shit up please only had it for one song you're done like you have one chance to play some good shit if I'm being honest with you, your first song has to be a banger or else you're probably not going to get past Aux ever again, unless they forget about that. So that's why today I'm trying to help you out by picking out the songs that you should never play on Aux. Number one, Carnival. Okay, this one's just a given. In the first couple of weeks, this song. Okay, was, I can like, somewhat was, agree with that. Like, like everybody like, fucked with it, but now I feel like TikTok just ruined the song. All I think of when I hear Carnival is that stupid ass TikTok. Okay, I can agree with this one, low key, low key. Being I can agree with this one, like, like, like low key. Like, I like Carnival and Loki. When I say that, I feel like I, I listen to Carnival when it's with like Finn a lot because, like, you know. Carnival slash the Finn remix, Loki. I feel like it's kind of fire. But Loki, hearing the song now, all I really think about is like this party. Like I listen to Finn Carnival somewhat, but I don't listen to it as much as Finn. And if I do, it's because it's because of this. So like you know, Loki, maybe people shouldn't be playing this in the Ox. You know, I feel like it's still like a good song, but you know what? I don't blame him. A dumbass when driving while Carnival was playing in the car. So, you know, I just couldn't. Yeah, that's that what I'm talking about. The same ever again. And there's only so many times you can hear it before it just gets super repetitive. And again, this is all just my opinion. You know, if you and your friends really fuck with Carnival, I, I guess play Carnival. I, I don't care. But me personally, I'm not putting on Carnival in my car, bro. Number two, we have Vibes by DaBaby. <laughs> and I think everybody knows why this song should not be played. Yeah. I feel like the I, reason. I, Loki you want to say this is another one i feel like tiktok got into at that show and number two the fact that this yeah the controversy and somewhat tiktok loki teams in like the rap space like their careers die so fast like before the whole the baby meme came out vibes was a hit like i was bumping that shit all the time number three Dance Monkey. I have never heard Wait, what is this one? So many times in my entire life. And honestly, that's probably why I Wait, who's the artist for this one? Hold up. So many goddamn times. <laughs> At that point, bro, you might as well put on the fucking radio. I mean, we're going to get the same shit anyway. So, uh, if you play Dance Monkey, you're most likely getting Ox taken away from you. So, I mean, if you really want to I'm going to guess this is another kid song unless this is actual popular song. Is that Ox core but I feel like well, hands. Next we have any song made for TikTok. Like if you don't know anything past okay this one i can agree with this one i can agree with and also hold up for some reason there's um a hospital truck near me so hold up all right i had to go deal with that but anyway yeah so i could somewhat agree with this like loki sometimes i'll hear like a tiktok song i'm like wait hold up hold up and then i actually listen to the song on like youtube because I, I have youtube music i don't have spotify so please don't disrespect me and sometimes i like it but then sometimes it's like eh, i don't like really like one line it's because like of a certain edit so it's like i, I can't agree with this low key sometimes i can agree with this like i'm one of those niggas that actually sometimes like likes a song but it's because of tiktok and because of, like an edit but outside of that how are you gonna turn up to that song and yes i know some songs go viral on tiktok that are good but people actually know the entire thing like if your song was just made to be like a sound on tiktok you're cooked. No one is going to know past the first 30 seconds or whatever. You're going to find Yeah, sometimes people aren't going to know like a certain uh, the like entire song. Example, They're just going to know like a certain line. Is when Ice Spice was first blowing up, nobody knew the lyrics.
hearts to munch. Not a single soul. They only knew the TikTok sound. So when she did a show, they turned up for about the I mean, they're hours. probably gonna know the lines for like whatever edit it was used by Loki when it's like Yeah, they're probably not gonna know the entire song. For those of you that actually use the app, you know which songs I'm talking about. Next we have Rich Baby Daddy featuring Sexy Red. Okay, uh, yeah. I think Sexy Red is like Ice Spice where it's like there's only like a certain line people are gonna know, but they are not gonna know the entire song like loki like i like sexy red but like i was definitely one of those niggas where i'm like i only know specific lines the first bars dropped in this song already just made me and probably a lot of other people hella uncomfortable this is the chorus the opening line bend that ass over let that <laughs> yeah this is what i'm talking about like i knew this line but the rest of the song i did not know that shit i'm not listening i could have named the lyrics in my mind loki oh yeah yo do not let me yeah okay this one I can definitely agree with like YouTube diss tracks from like what 2016 to uh, I want to say 2019 like okay sometimes this, I would probably say sometimes they were like somewhat all right because sometimes the person making it is actually someone who makes songs like I would like say one is like I want to say like KSI before the drama um boy in the band I think that, like you know before you know he was like touching kids but then you got people like you don't know Logan Paul Jake Paul Rice Gum uh fucking team 10 rap or whatever it's called like yeah like those people i'm like okay you can, don't play those shit in the car don't play that shit in the car because it's very ass me catch you playing like just like two packs of ass loki i cannot imagine a car full of people turning up to dream it's not possible there's no way or if you like queue up a rice gum loki if someone wants is the uh, like a dream song i i would generally be concerned this track at a function people are gonna be staring at you like this and you will never live that down you'll be known as the guy that put dream on the ox and you know that's a that's a pretty loki does it to have i'm not gonna lie to you Next week, like outside of a kid, like a kid's party, no one should like be playing like a like a dream song. Like what I mean, like like a, like like a kid's party because it was so weird. I mean, like someone who likes Minecraft but actually likes Dream as a content creator, not like a album aged. It eventually grew on people. So the people who really fucked with it since the beginning, like they, I guess they had that acquired taste already. But what I'm getting at pretty much is, do not play something that is like very niche. Play something that I mean, even know if not everybody knows the song like just anybody walking on the street would fuck with unless the audience that you are in you know already fits that acquired taste but in the scenarios when you're not you know you gotta tee up you know really understand you know which songs that you listen to that nobody else would fuck with like we all have those type of songs because if you play those type of songs on ox everybody's just gonna look at you funny next we have any song from like a tv show or a movie not like a song that's in a tv show or a movie i mean unless it's garbage Don't okay this like, one i can somewhat I can agree with this everything is awesome from the lego movie like this why would you ever put yeah okay this one this i can agree so with loki like hold up self ironically turning up to it but they're like as someone who, who like sometimes listens to the songs from like a tv show a movie or a cartoon because sometimes it's like pretty fire like like i'm gonna use like what Phineas and Ferb, Steamy Universe, and I'm I'm gonna use SpongeBob as an example. Like like songs from like those type of like cartoons. Like yeah, some of them is, are like mainly for kids, but sometimes you know they make a song that's like Loki. It's got a fire that like you know you could actually play it in a song or like some kind of convention. Shit, I would even like say something like I don't know, Teen Titans Go. Like they have like so many like good songs that I feel like they Loki. They, they some of them mainly are mainly for like kid parties, but sometimes I feel like you can actually play it in a like like a party for like i don't know teenagers or adults it's sometimes i feel like it's kind of fire loki there is not a day but loki want to say like everything is awesome and like um the catchy song from lego movie 2 yeah don't play that shit like don't play that shit in the, in the party please this is a song about heartbreak like i don't think that would get anybody in the car turn at least in my experience lucid dreams was so actually like 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 juice world and like uh all girls are the same yeah i don't feel like juice world's a really like good like artist to play at a party like in my opinion it's it's more like a 
like a and artist you you listen to just to get over like heartbreak or something in my opinion on radio stations and just in general honestly but yeah let me know what you think comment down below what songs you think should never be on aux but yeah check out this video on the end screen and i'll catch you on the next one peace out later so guys, that was the video. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And Loki, when I said I agreed with literally most of what word I said in this, Loki. Like nothing was capped, nothing was fake. It's like, yeah, the most things they really shouldn't like be played. Like, like unless like the atmosphere or something. Mm. Like YouTube diss tracks. Like literally, I would probably say the percentage of it is like, like ninety percent of YouTube diss tracks are like very trash, and only ten percent of it are like I would probably say actually good or at least decent to play. I don't know, play at a song or something. Then he said like you know popular songs. I'm like popular songs. I feel like you know sometimes I feel like you should have a mix of popular songs that should be played at a party then a mix of very old like you know popular songs that should also be played at a party because like you know combine the mix because like you know sometimes you combine the mix and then he's like you know you have a hype hype party because you're playing something people used to enjoy and people still enjoy because it's an all-time banger and then you know we have songs that people listen to now that's a banger and everything else i feel like i agreed with it was just like you know a little bit of context but overall i agreed with the entire video so not gonna lie word i dub video dub video i really enjoyed this so um yeah that was the video. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please subscribe to the bell and get notified when I upload a new video. Comment what do you guys want to react to next. So yes, that was the video. I'll see you guys later. Bye. Pups.